Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So I have the latest releases from Magpie Beauty here. They are the new Dust Flakes. So from left to right, we have Starla, Rosanna, Trixie Bell, and Periwinkle. Now Starla is the most gorgeous collection of silver holographic flakes. She is stunning. And then the next three are Too Faced flakes. So they will shift. So Rosanna gives a pink gold green shift. Trixie Bell gives a green gold shift and Periwinkle gives like a beautiful purple blue green shift. So I'm going to show you a couple of methods for each of the flakes just so you get an idea on how to apply these. First I'm going to show you with the Too Faced flakes. This is Periwinkle that I'm using here and I've got two coats of Black Betty here cured and I'm just going to take a flat gel brush and pick the flakes up with that and then just press them into the tacky layer. Now with this method they can sometimes curl up so that's why I'm using a gel brush because I can pat these down and get them really smooth before top coating. So this is what that looks like before top coating and hopefully you can see all those different colours coming through there. And immediately before top coating make sure all those pieces are stuck down and you don't have any bits poking over the side or sticking up. So my second method is how you would use if you were to chrome the nail. So I've got Don't Be Tacky and I've cured it for half the time which is 30 seconds in an LED. Then I'm just taking the flakes on an eyeshadow applicator and I'm just rubbing it into that layer. And what it does, it breaks up the flakes and gives it more of a smoother chrome type finish. So depending on what look you want, you can do either of these methods and they still would look equally as gorgeous and then when you're happy you can cure for the remaining 30 seconds then top coat again and do a full cure so as you can see with this method the flakes are a lot more broken up and they do lay a lot smoother and flatter but as I say it's entirely up to you I think you do get more of a color shift applying them to the tacky layer but if you really want that smooth, chromey sort of finish, then go with the second method. So on to Starla. Oh, she is just heavenly. This is perfect for galaxy nails. Hopefully you can see there how holographic the flakes are. So I'm going to use both methods exactly the same again. So I'm going to use the tacky layer on top of Black Betty again and just using my very well loved magpie detailer brush i'm just going to pick up tiny little bits and just dab them onto the nail and it was when i was applying this i really thought this would be perfect for galaxy nails so i mean that looks absolutely stunning on its own but i grabbed my Too faced dust collection and then went a bit mad and started applying those and just randomly dabbing them onto the nail and I think it gave just a really gorgeous effect. And just like seriously wow in real life this nail looks amazing so method two is like the chrome method again where you're gonna get the flakes totally broken up and it's gonna give you more of like a linear hollow effect so again I've just cured don't be tacky for half the time and I'm taking my eyeshadow applicator again loading it up with flakes and I'm just rubbing those into the nail and you can be quite vigorous with this because you want the flakes to be really broken up so it gives you 
a really gorgeous hollow effect. So once you do start rubbing and burnishing that in, these lay lovely and flat and oh my gosh, this is so freaking hollow. And Starla doesn't just look amazing over black. I've done it here over four magpie gels, the pink, the purple, blue and green. And as you can see, it just takes on that background color and gives you that really lovely hollow sparkle. And then these are the two side by side. So definitely try those with galaxy nails. And if you don't have the Too Faced dust yet either, you need those too. So here are all the flakes over black and then Starlet in the bottom right hand corner there. And then all the four together. So I really hope you enjoyed this one guys. Um, please leave me a like and subscribe if you want to and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.